Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, as you saw by the title, I'm going to be trying a tanning bed for the very first time. I know I look a little bit crazy. That's because I was just um, working out, but now I'm gonna get my tan on. So here is the tanning bed. I've done so much research on like lotions to use, like chapsticks, if I need tanning oil, how long and all that. So I think, I don't really know how the levels or anything work, but I know that I'm gonna go in for five minutes at the most. And I think I'm gonna do like a level one or level two, see how I feel. And this morning I shaved, exfoliated, moisturized, all of that. Um, I know that I'm going to, I'm gonna go in naked. <laughs> I'm gonna put on my goggles and some chapstick. And then once I get out and I shower and everything, I'm gonna moisturize really well. So wish me luck and I will let you guys know how it goes. Okay guys, so it has been like seven minutes later. I was literally in there for I think like four and a half minutes, not even the full five minutes, but I think my face is a little bit red because it gets a little bit hot in there. And honestly, I was kind of nervous at first. It's like kind of scary getting into this contraption. I don't know. It was a little bit crazy. Um, like I said, a little bit scary. So I think what I'm gonna do is just, I know that sometimes tans take a couple of days for them to come through. So I will insert some before and after pictures right here. This is like immediately before and immediately right after. So let me know if you guys see any difference. Hey guys, so it's actually been a couple of days later since I did tanning for the first time. And I actually decided that because there was no like noticeable huge difference after the first time, I'm just gonna make this video kind of my process of tanning over a few weeks. Um, so yeah, definitely this week I'm planning on doing tanning again for the second time. So we will see if there's any big changes after that, but I'm assuming it's probably gonna take maybe three or four times, but I will keep you guys updated every time I go tanning. Okay guys, so my face is super red, I look crazy. I just worked out, but I'm getting ready to hop in the tanning bed for the second time. It's been about four days since the last time I went in and I went for four minutes today. I'm going in for five minutes, so let's go. Hey guys, so I just finished working out and I'm getting ready to go tanning again day four. Today I'm going to go in for five minutes and stay in for the full five minutes. You guys saw last time I was gonna go in for five minutes. I got nervous and I only was in there for four. So today I'm going to stick to it and do it for five minutes. So let's get started. Okay, so I just finished. I stayed in for the full five minutes. The next time I'm gonna tan is gonna be Friday and I'm gonna go in for six minutes. And I also didn't know that Planet Fitness has a stand-up bed. So maybe that'll be a whole nother video, like trying a stand-up tanning bed instead of this lay-down one. I actually think I might like the lay or the stand-up one more just because this one I kind of get like nervous and claustrophobic and I don't know. Hey guys, so today is tanning day six, I believe. Five. I think it's tanning day six. Today I'm going in for the longest time that I have yet, which is six minutes. I'm a little bit nervous, but I think I'll be okay. But today is the last day that I'm going to be filming for this tanning video. So I'm gonna stay in for the entire six minutes and the entire cool down so I can give you guys like an accurate experience of using a tanning bed. So let's get started. <coughs> Okay guys, so I just finished the six minutes and I also did the regular like two minute cool down. Basically the cool down is just like some like normal lights kick on in there and the fans just blow on you just so you can chill out. And if you like 
wake up a little bit before you get back out. My overall experience with the tanning bed has been pretty well. I was definitely taking it really seriously. Um, I started out like you guys saw, I did like four minutes, I think three different times, and then one to five minutes a couple times, and then today was six minutes the longest I've done it. So I definitely have noticed results. Um, it's a super even tan from head to toe. And also, like I said, if you take it seriously like I did, you're not gonna get burnt or anything like that. I mean, it's definitely scary your first few times, but as long as you take it really slow, you'll be fine. And and a lot of videos that I watched was people, girls specifically, using all these like fancy tanning products and, and just stuff before they got in. I used nothing. I literally just went in, did my different intervals throughout the weeks. And then once I got out, I showered and like moisturized really well. So really, I think that's all you need to do. I mean, if you're looking for a much stronger and quicker tan, then use those tanning products. But if you're in no rush, you're just taking your time, just like, just like me, your first experience just trying to get a tan throughout the winter time, definitely you don't need any of those. Just make sure you moisturize afterwards. But I am gonna post the results from the very first time that I went in until now. I noticed kind of a huge difference and I'm actually really happy. It gave me a very pretty, subtle tan and I'm probably gonna start doing this every winter just to keep my tan going throughout the year. One thing I forgot to mention is make sure you either wear the goggles without the string or just move the placement of the string during your time in the tanning bed. So that is my tanning bed experience. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys subscribe. I post new videos every single week and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.